This cannot be what I think it is. <gasps> I was right. It wasn't. What is going on, guys? I am Black Ops Amazing. Welcome back to another Zombies video. And today, we are going to be talking about Dr. Edward Richthofen and our newly introduced character, Dr. Monty. Since the PC version of Garo Kravy is now released, we can go through the game files and get some awesome quotes from our characters. And today, I want to specifically focus on some interesting things that Richthofen says, which kind of indicates towards him knowing about Monty all this time. Throughout the giant, the eyes of Drache, Garo Kravy, Movie, Richtofen's made out that he doesn't really know anything about Dr. Monty whenever he gets a gumball. He's like, who is this? Who is this Dr. Monty character? He kind of acts like he doesn't know anything about him, apart from obviously the gumballs. But then as we go further on throughout the maps, we get some more interesting quotes that kind of hint towards him knowing Monty or knowing about him. And now in Garrett Karevi, things start to heat up even more. We know Richtofen knows about the secret, supposedly, of Maxus's. In Richtofen's trailer, he doesn't specifically say whose secret he knows, but because in the trailer he is talking about Maxis, we presumed, and from what we heard as Xbox Shima as well, that the secret that Richtofen knows is of Maxus's and not Monty. Because if it was of Monty, then that would mean that Richtofen definitely knew about him from the very beginning. But as we see in the giant, Richtofen's making out that he doesn't really know about him. Yet all throughout our zombies maps, he's been hinting towards him. Going to and Draco, we get a few quotes from Richtofen that kind of hint towards him knowing about Monty. And then we come over to Garad Karovi and we get these. Dr. Monty, Max has only ever alluded to your existence. I think I like you, Dr. Monty. You have balls. Gumballs. He first off says, Dr. Monty, Maxis only ever alluded to your existence. Alluded, if you want to know the definition, means suggest or call attention to indirectly or basically hint at. Richtofen is saying that Maxis mentioned Monty, but he never went on to discuss him. He most probably only ever mentioned his name maybe once to Richtofen. He would hint towards him, but would never actually explain who Monty is. And right now, we don't really know who he is. We have this idea that he is this godly type figure that has this power to change things. We know in the game he has been given us these chalk drawings on the wall. He's been given us the mystery box, the perk machines, the gumballs. So if he's able to help us out, he would come across as this godly type figure. And Richtofen is saying that Maxis has only ever hinted towards Monty existing, but not gone on to explain anything else about him. And I think maybe that was because Maxis didn't even know if Monty existed for sure. We know in radios that we heard in the giant, Zetsubo no Shima, that we have this character called He. Now, I believe He is Dr. Monty, and Maxis told us that He came up to the house and he took Samantha away. Maxis also said that when he saw he, this to Maxis was a surprise. He denied possibility, he denied physics, logic, and if he is Dr. Monty and that's how Maxis is describing him, again, Maxis is making Dr. Monty sound like some godly type figure that really shouldn't exist that is denying logic. We know Maxis is a scientist, so him working in that field of research, you would suspect wouldn't believe in a higher power that would be able to control things from up above. So when you have this godly type figure knocking on your house being Monty, obviously this is going to leave Maxis surprised. So it comes across and it seems like Dr. Monty is an all-powerful being. He is, and as I'm going to refer to, our god in the zombies universe. Yourself, Monty. We all know how important you must be. In the next quote, Richtofen says, Why don't you show yourself, Monty? We all know how important you must be. Richtofen, even though he doesn't say it, kind of makes it sound like he already knows about Dr. Monty. He knows his purpose. He knows what he's going to do. He knows he's working with Maxis, which I believe he is. He knows Dr. Monty is listening. And it sounds like he's indirectly saying to him, Why don't you show yourself? We all know how important you must be. Like I said, I believe that Richtofen has known about Monty probably since Origins whether it was before or just after they opened the portal in France. But as we hear Monty say at the end of Goro Krovi, Richtofen is supposed to requirements. We don't need him anymore, almost sounding like Monty wants Richtofen killed off. We know Richtofen has the blood vials as an insurance policy to protect himself against the secret. And then if you go back to the giant, as early as that, you should remember Richtofen telling Takio that he will hear voices. Yeah, Takeo, you will hear voices. Even ones that will not always speak to me. Richtofen says to Takio, listen to the voices in your head. And the voice in our head in Gorad Karovi is Dr. Monty. At the end, he only decides to talk to Takio, Nikolai and Dempsey as he doesn't want Richtofen to hear what he is saying because it's about him. And as Richtofen is saying, yes, Takio, you will hear voices 
even ones that will not always talk to me, referring to Dr. Monty. That's exactly what Monty does at the end of Goro Karuvi. He tells our characters that they are coming to the house, but Richtofen is no longer needed. And this quote is telling us that Richtofen knows that Monty is going to talk to our characters. He knew that Monty was going to tell our characters this at the end of Goro Karuvi and was going to leave Richtofen out. So it's almost like Richtofen pretty much knew exactly what Monty said to our characters, even though he didn't hear it. And the next quote, Richtofen says, <laughs> I have heard his voice. I wonder if the others have. I will find Maxis soon. Everything is almost as it should be. Come on, Monty. I don't know how much longer I can wait. Hmm, I have heard his voice but I wonder if the others have. I will find Maxis soon, everything is almost as it should be. And then he says, come on Monty, I don't know how much longer I can wait. Then I have this last quote that I wanna show you that kind of got me. Like I said earlier in the video, we have Maxis addressing someone as he. He says, he came to the house, he will explain everything to you. In Garrett Crovey, Dr. Monty came in and explained everything to our characters. So I just wanna make it clear that I really do think he and we have so much evidence towards it now that he, whenever our characters, or Maxis in particular, refers to someone as he, he is talking about Dr. Monty. So it was Monty who came to the house, but as Richtofen says in this last quote, That's right. Nikolai, he is the last. Once we have him contained, he will come for us. Different he. Obviously. That's right. Nikolai, he is the last. Once we have him contained, he will come for us. He then says, different he obviously. He says different he because obviously at the start of this quote he was referring to Nikolai as he saying that you know he Nikolai is the last but then at the end he says he will come for us and says different he obviously meaning he's no longer talking about Nikolai and is in fact more than likely since we have he and he is Dr. Monty talking about Dr. Monty so Richtofen says he will come to us Dr. Monty will come to us which should show that even though Richtofen hasn't shown it he's known about Dr. Monty all this time since the giant Drazen Drakkar Zetsubon Oshima before we heard him in Gored Karovi Richtofen all this time has known about Dr. Monty he's known he's here he's known in his presence he's known that Dr. Monty has been listening he's probably known that Dr. Monty has been to the house with Maxis and together Monty and Maxis have come up with this plan and he even knows that Monty is holding a secret and is going to betray and probably kill Richtofen out. Everything that we didn't know about Monty, Richtofen knew a very long time ago and although he's hinted towards his existence, towards him knowing about him, he's never actually spoke about him or directly spoken to him because I believe Richtofen knows this could ruin his secret, which is the blood vials. And if that's ruined, then Richtofen's insurance policy is useless, which could cause Richtofen to get into big trouble and means he may well die. So that is why he's had to keep this a secret. But definitely some very interesting quotes. Hopefully you have enjoyed the video. I've got some awesome content coming for you guys soon. I've just got to uh, really work hard on it. So I'm trying to get that out. Let me know if you'd like another top five zombies. And if you would, what would you like it on? A top five secrets, origins. Would you like an origin storyline? Because that's something I'd definitely love to do as we come over to Revelations. As we know, there are a ton of links there. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Drop a like rating if you have. Make sure you are subscribed for more Zombies videos and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you and goodbye.